Mount Kenya is the tallest in the country at 5,199 meters above sea level and is probably the ultimate hiking and climbing destination in Kenya. One of the entry points to the mountain is through the Chogora Gate. Despite the cold experienced on the mountain, there are several crater lakes, the largest being Lake Alice, located 3,400 meters on your way up, which offers scenic views for climbers. Let's now go on a journey to Lake Alice with George Maringa. An expedition to Mount Kenya requires the right mode of transport if you want to go by foot due to the terrain within. Out of the three popular routes of climbing Mount Kenya, the Chogoria route, which is on the east side of the mountain, is without question the most scenic, more so due to the beautiful landscapes and exotic flora. The Chogoria Park Gate, which is about 29 kilometers from Chogoria town, gives you an opportunity to view the tallest peak, Batian, at 5,199 meters above sea level. Adjacent to it are other peaks such as Nelian, Linana, and hills such as the Morgue Hills. And so the journey begins, one that will see us pass the savanna grassland, which comes with its challenges. But apart from the hassle, you're bound to come across these crystal clear streams and tributaries, also known as Tunidi, which together form the famous Nidhi River. The geographical saying of the higher you go, the cooler it becomes plays out as the temperatures go lower as you go up. For today, our expedition takes us to 3,400 meters above sea level, where we find the largest crater lake on Mount Kenya, Lake Alice. <laughs> she flows silently, hiding and nurturing precious life beneath. It is, it's the big, biggest lake on the mountain, and uh, it has trout, which People come and do trout fishing here. We also take it as a second day when camping and climbing Mount Kenya of Orient. Now, interestingly, there is a myth attached to this source of life that rain falls when you throw stones inside. And so we experiment, some of us even throwing huge ones for that matter said to be the most romantic lake. There was a myth when you were growing up that Mount Ellis, when you throw a stone, it starts raining immediately. A short while later, low dark clouds pass right in front of us and it gets freezing cold, a sign that the rains could be upon us anytime. Whether that was coincidence or confirmation of the myth, we may never know. Ukitembea dunia hii itakuwa ngumu kupata ziwa ingine However, should you need to retreat before climbing the mountain, these cottages, also known as bandas, are a safe abode for visitors, and you're bound to get some company during the night, as these grazers could come close to your door. But not to worry, they cannot break in. When morning comes, they walk away steadily as the majestic snow-capped Mount Kenya penetrates through the low-flying clouds. Back to the lakes, you are required to be in good health before climbing, as well as adorning yourself with appropriate warm clothing as temperatures get lower than you may be used to. At 3,400 meters above sea level, Lake Ellis is the largest crater lake in Mount Kenya that provides a scenic view to domestic and international tourists. George Maringa, KTN News in Mount Kenya through the Chogoria route in Darakanidi County.